this is Trigger Happy Gal. Hey, what's up you guys? It's your girl Nicolas and today I'm finally back with a new video but today is not a travel vlog. It's actually a freaking gaming video. Yes, that's right. I finally decided to record myself playing PUBG Mobile. So now I'm just camping on this bridge waiting for the zone to come in and watch me play this game very smoothly with a suppressed M16. Don't forget to leave a like, comment and also share this video guys. So now let's look in the water to see if there are enemies swimming. And I was right. There was someone swimming in the water. Time to kill this dude. <laughs> How many shots is it going to take to kill this guy? There you go. GG Daniel. So now I'm just checking where the next zone will be. And I'm about to hop in my Jeep and loot the guys that I killed earlier. I think I killed one bot and one actual person. Uh, the bot was like running towards me, not firing at all, which is not really a competition, if you know what I'm saying. So, yeah. And the other guy, I blew his head right off. Oh, yeah. So, I'm just grabbing some 5.56 ammo because why not? It's not like I have enough. Like, I'm almost 400 rounds. So, this guy had a time six scope which is amazing because i prefer the six times over the four times comment down below what kind of um scope you like to use when you play pubg so now i'm just popping some pills because i got tons and uh yeah i like i like popping pills in pubg though you know not in real life mm -hmm. so as i was driving on this bridge i saw some person running outside of the play zone which is quite dumb if you ask me it was probably a bot i hope it was a bot So now I'm just driving up this hill and just looking around, you know, maybe I can run some enemies over. Then I decided to actually stop right here and not go towards the compound because there might be people there. And yeah, I was actually really cautious in this game. Like I kept looking around, you know, always be alert. Because we don't want people sneaking up behind our backs and blow our heads off. So there I can see a person in the D-stones. And yes, blew his head right off. I love the M16, you guys. Especially when it's suppressed or with a compensator. Like, damn. That gun never filled me. Then I see another person actually in the field. And it took me quite a while to actually hit this guy because he was really running fast. And this was probably a bot, I think. Or maybe not. I don't know. So I'm just checking for more people who might be running out in the open. Then it's that person right behind my back running towards me. GG Hannah, GG. Then I just went prone, making sure that nobody sees us while we're popping pills again because why not? I'm still checking the compound because I know that there are people there because there's a jeep right there which is not a spawn so I'm quite sure that there are actually people there but I couldn't see them so now I'm just going to the safe zone it's 
making sure that nobody shoots us from the compound. Then I actually heard some shootings right in front of me, right in that compound. And again, I didn't see them. Well, I'm just blind, I don't know. And I heard some more shootings, but I don't know where they came from. The guy was probably suppressed. And I finally saw the guy by the container and BAM! He's dead by a headshot. Sorry, Wicked. Or am I? <laughs> I'm just checking again if I didn't miss anybody. And there you go, another person running. And bam, you're dead. Sorry, Brian. Now I'm just boosting again for the end game. There's a buggy. Did you guys see that glitch? Like right there. It was a glitch. Like I could actually see the person through the wall of that warehouse. It was quite funny. Now they're just shooting so far on my left. And then Yet again, I can't see them. It's so annoying. There's a buggy over there. There's probably a person inside that small house. I just check this side, making sure that nobody is hiding down there. And I kind of got scared because I really couldn't see anyone, so I decided to stay under here for a while. But then I was like, oh, maybe it's not a good idea. And I kept hearing footsteps. So now I'm about to throw a stun grenade at this guy, wherever he's at. I'm just throwing some grenades to scare him off and I actually had no idea where this person was so I just decided to throw grenades everywhere oh there's a person that I couldn't hit because I was on a time six which is really stupid of me. 
So don't scope guys if you're actually close range. Just try and use a red dot or a hollow or maybe even iron sight. And the guy on my left stole my kill. Damn it. So now I know that the guy is actually inside the warehouse. I thought he was actually on the roof, but he wasn't. So he's probably in the warehouse. Decided to uh, throw a molly at him. I don't know if he actually took damage, but yeah. So now we're in a waiting game. I don't know how long I sat in this little house. Just to wait for the other people to show up or, you know, make a mistake by shooting and then it would just give their position away. Yeah, I think I was about like whole five minutes just sitting here and looking around. So on the map you can see some footsteps on our right and bam headshot sorry sexy pawn <laughs> so now it's just between me and the guy inside the warehouse i didn't have any grenades left i'm just waiting for him to come out actually i didn't want to rush him There you go, some shots inside to take this opportunity to rush in. And there you go, winner, winner, chicken dinner, baby. Hope you guys liked this video. Don't forget to thumbs up and share this video. Bye. Kiki, you love me. Are you riding? Speak, you never have to leave beside me. I want you, and I need you I'm down for you, I always pay me You love me, are you right?